Hello, family and friends. Welcome into your spiritual nourishment. I am your shaman empress, aka the shaman hummingbird, Alpha Lucas. Let's take a look at you, sexy ass Alpha Lucas. All right, guys. So, you are a constellation. You're not a sign. Alpha Lucas, anyone that is born under this energy can and will resonate with this message. All right. The energy is fluent and will resonate back and forth between you and your person. Sun, moon, rising, and Venus. There's no energies. Any third party energy will be sun, moon, and rising. Also, entanglement. They're watching you. Alpha Lucas, they is watching you. Yes. Yes. Honey, and they're dreaming about you. They've been thinking about you, four swords. Okay. Um, this person, this person has been really thinking about y'all. And this connection, this relationship. It, 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 they've been shining a lot of light on things. The good and the bad. Also, whether or not they should communicate. And it looks like they want to communicate. Why? For some of you guys, it's, it's the sex. <laughs> Child, this person. It's the sex. And they've been thinking about the sex. Child, I can't make it up. The ace of ones and the two of cups. Now, for some of you guys, this is a big wand. Damn it. I'm so... This wand is wanding. Okay. Now, yeah. Someone here could be wanting to have some kind of makeup sex this weekend, Alpha Lucas. Almighty, beautiful universe and Holy Spirit. Let's see what's going on with you, Alpha Lucas. Almighty, beautiful universe and Holy Spirit. I think and I love you so much. Can you give me more messages for Alpha Lucas? Thank you. Mm. There's something about splitting the decks in threes today. I don't know what that is. Yeah. King of Wands. Yes, honey. Mm-hmm. Cancer Leo energy. This person here, for some of you guys, has really been digging deep. Hermit energy. For some of you guys, this person has been thinking about you since they ghosted you. Mm -hmm. This is someone that ghosted you for some of you guys. Yeah. Yep, they've been thinking about you. Dang, man, they've been having a tower. Uh-huh. Yes, yeah, three of cups. Wanting to reconnect. Mm, let's see. Mm -hmm. Strong fire energy here. Look at that. We got the seven of coins. This could have been going on for some time. Now that it's been on this person's mind. They've been um, waiting on this. Someone here could feel like they're waiting as well. Nine of swords. And, but they're nervous. This could be why you guys are waiting, why they're waiting, why you're waiting. Jimin and energy and Tessoria in there. Yes, honey. Three of swords. This is someone I could have, uh, know they left you hanging. Know that uh, this king of wands, know that they have broken your heart. This could have been because of a third party person, a third party mindset. Because if this person was um, talking to more than one person, people no one really had a level and they was just doing them then it's them so there was no one above you it's just what they chose to do now for some of you guys if it's a person they there was someone above you guys or they had you entangled with another person let's see yes the six of coins the queen of swords Oh, yeah, the King of Swords. Okay, uh-uh. For some of you guys, this is someone that's been thinking about you. They want to come towards you, but you're coming out as the Queen of Swords. You're coming out as the Queen of Swords because this is someone, the King of One and the King of Swords is here that have been talking to somebody else. Why? This is someone here that could have been in a relationship, the King of Swords and the Queen of Swords, and they are no longer that in that third-party situation. They could have been heartbroken. They they also could be dealing with heartbreak from a situation here. Now, you know if this is you or you this other person. But there's two kings and there's a damn queen of swords. Now, for some of you guys, I could also... Um, 
be talking to the same sex relationship because I did hear that. Now, this that this is why someone here that ghosted you been thinking of you from the past. This person um also been missing you sexually. Someone here could think that they're gonna come and have makeup sex with you, and that's gonna get them back in your energy. So please be careful with that. With the Six of Pentacles. Give you a little time. Give you a little box. Give you a little, uh, you know, D-I-C-K, a little one. Mm. And that'll get them right back in here. Okay? So, you need to be mindful here. Okay? They uh, plan on slowly coming towards you. All right? Just so you know that, this is also why they're slowly coming towards you. For a lot of you guys, when this person does do this, this will be at night or midday. This is also someone now, the king of ones and the six of coins, they got the time to give. Now, they got a little bit of extra money to spend because they went through a, already a breakup or from another person. If this is someone new and you're not on for someone old, this person has went through a breakup, could be broken hearted, could be still be going through um, some kind of broken heart. So, please be careful here. All right. Nine of swords and a three of swords. Also, um, you might even see or notice some things about them being a little bit nervous, hesitant about starting something new. Taking leader in a new relationship. Reconnecting here. They could still be having a little bit of energy here that they are dealing with. With the uh, queen and the king of swords and the six of pentacles here. With this other person. It could be that they have kids with this other person. It could be a, not a, a numerous of things. Now, before we go any deeper, we're going to get into your angel number. I have 793 so far that I am seeing for you guys. So, let's get that. Okay, guys. As long as you've got your numbers, add them up. Even single digitally, there's no right or wrong way. We're going to do 7936. I'm still going to hashtag 793 down below. Okay. This is a message that constantly tells you that life is always funny because those who want you to fall will someday need your assistance. Oh my God. This person chose this person over you. Now they want to come back. Like I said, it could be because they need something from you. They want something from you. Your energy, your essence, your pureness. For some of you guys, you're this damn king of ones. Yeah. Because they were in a king. This is the relationship they were in. King and the Queen of Swords with the Three of Swords. Yeah. You're in your masculine. If you are a female, you're real alpha energy right now. If you're a man, you're alpha, alpha. Okay? They know that. Mm. This is someone here that also feels like that was a mistake putting you in a situation like this. The Three of Swords and the Six of Pentacles when it comes to your time uh, energy. Because they realize... Uh, it, you obviously you're doing something that they didn't get in their own relationship. Now they found the need for you, a spot for you that they didn't before. Okay, this person is definitely nervous about coming back. Okay, it could have been a little bit of time since they saw you. All right, so they're nervous. They're also very nervous on to talk to you. What to say? They could also know that you feel some kind of way. Three of Swords, Nine of Swords, King of Swords. Okay, so they could also, you know, feel that way as well. All right, I don't feel like this person wants to touch too much base on the Queen of Swords. Now, this Queen of Swords got some kind of hurt receipts in her hand. We're gonna get into that. All right, this is also someone that doesn't want you to talk to this Queen of Swords because of the receipts in her hand, and we need to know what the receipts are. They also know that if this person, yeah. Because we got the Six of Pentacles and the Queen of Swords, honey. And whatever this is, they know this is going to put you in your masculine energy, mad even. Even open your eyes, make you take a step back, the hangman. Like, excuse me. Let's see what that is. We're going, I'm being pulled to these cards. Hold on, hold on, hold on. They don't want me to get... Okay. Okay, no. No. Okay, no. All right. These ones. Okay. They want me to use these ones, guys, so we'll rock with these ones. All right, let's see what's going on. What do you want to show me? Let's see. What is this? 
Some of that. Oh, my beautiful universe and Holy Spirit. What's in this? Yep. Mm -hmm. Whatever this is, is to stop you from connecting with this person. Yeah. Yep. And, and this is someone here. They want you to lose uh, them or lose the connection. All right. What is it? What's going on here? Yes. I told you strategy. Whatever this is, this is a strategy to block um this blessing that's coming in between you and this person here now for some of you guys it, this person could be dealing with some kind of illness yeah now for some of you guys this person is going to tell you that they pay all the bills they're going to tell you that this person ain't got no goddamn job yeah Yep, 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 yep. Yeah, they were sick and tired of this person. They had to keep pushing. There was a lot of... They're going to tell you about the fights they had. Yep, I told you. They pay all the bills. This person ain't got no damn job. And with, and with this, whatever this is and how deep this goes, this is to scare you away, to scare you. Just so you know that. Yes. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Um... I want to see your energy real quick. Show me the King of Wands. Damn. I just saw the Five of Pentacles and the Queen of Cups. This is a lot of energy. Let's try to break this down. So, so for some of you guys, you, you were left out in the cold and you feel left out in the cold still. Yep, from this King of Swords. Here his ass go again. Yeah. Six of Swords. Now, for some of you guys, even though you feel like this, you still feel strong enough to have and hold a conversation with this person. All right? This is also someone here that even though they know you might feel mad, they still feel like a conversation needs to be had or they are strong enough to finally have a conversation with you guys. Yeah, Four of Swords. And they have thought a lot about this. They have went around in their mind at least four different times about this. Yes, they're getting their strength up for this new store start. This is also to give you to get you apologize to apologize to you for ending this. Cause for some of yeah, cause for some of you guys, they picked this person over you damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it, and left damn you it. hanging. What's the hangman? Yeah. And turn out to be the Empress in reverse. Yep. And they thought they was going to be victorious. But no, they're not. Yep. Princes of Wands. This was, could have been a younger person. An immature person. I want to know more about the Queen of Swords. So this is what this person is going to try to do to get you guys to get you to walk away from this person. If you're going to be with them, you're going to have to pay all the bills. If you want to do this, this, and that, they start shit, they do this. That's their relationship. It's not y'all's. This person's going to try to project, project this person, their energy of this relationship on you. Every reason in a world of why they should not be with you. Now, they're also going to tell you at some point in time, this person could up with eight here and sickness here, have something. Even could have burnt them in a relationship. Obviously, if you if you were in a third party situation with this person, there could have been others. They can also tell you that this person cheats. They don't use condoms. Show me the Queen of Swords' energy. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Yep, and look, and she's watching it, this person. For some of you guys, she's going to find you through watching this person. Yep, you, the Queen of Pentacles. The person that this person finds wifey, the person that this person wants to make their next offer, this is someone this person would want to be with. And that's how they're going to find a queen of pentacles. Look at this shit, the five of swords. Can't make it up. That's how, yep, eight of, eight of swords. Shall hold up now. Yeah, now for some of you guys, don't, don't, don't. I do see a little argument start started here. Okay, a little argument could start. I don't want nobody getting, getting a little bit too deep. Police could get called. Okay, I don't know. I don't, I don't want nobody going to jail. All right, because some shit might be, uh, you know, going down this week and don't be popping up, but nobody tells us doing crazy shit. And it's like, I don't know you. You stalking him because he leaving you. That's y'all business. You know, you're, you know, that's their business. You know what I mean? That's how you explain it to that person. 
I, you are his past. That's not who, you know, that's just like you moving on from somebody. And their ex is going to tell you everything that y'all did. Like, you could be a whole new person now. Okay, um, here. You know, you're, you were always growing and evolving. But take it how it resonates with you and for you because it will be different for all you guys. There might be some things that you need to be alert about. Um, I just want to see a little bit more of this illness. What's the illness here in eight? Yeah, I told you. Someone here could t could tell you, you know, that this person has another child outside the outside of their marriage, outside of this common wealth. Wedding doesn't have to be a marriage. It it could be. This is also someone I could tell you that they they are um still married to keep this person stuck and keep you even stuck mentally, and you didn't know that. Yep, a gift. In the thief. Mm -hmm. This is someone here that's trying to steal your happiness. From being with this person. Look at this. Mercury thoughts. Whether this is a man or a woman. They on one. Uh... Let me see this King of Swords. What we need to know? I'm going to pull this deck. What we need to know about the King of Swords? This is someone that does not feel like things are going to be victorious right now at this time. That's why they haven't reached out yet with the Ace of Pentacles. Leo and all of my Earthbenders are here to Sori and Virgo and Capricorn. Yeah, that's why they have it. But when they do, they want to defend themselves or they're going to. And they're going to be in their feminine. For some of you guys, they're wishing and hoping that you're on their feminine too. Yep, the Knight of Cups and the Queen of Cups. There might be extra creative. Yeah, ding, ding. That's your confirmation as well. Ten of Pentacles, because they want to Ten of Pentacles you. Mm -hmm. They're going to also try to bring up the past to get you back, to juggle back in your feelings of why you shouldn't want to be without them, why you should reconnect. Yeah. Here, they're also going to tell you that they cut off that person that they had a new start with. Yeah. They they, they could have did shit quick, too quickly. They wasn't thinking. I want to know why they left you hanging. Why did they leave the collective hanging? What was the hangman? Why? Why did they leave Alpha Lucas hanging? Four, yep, yeah, four. They didn't think you were strong enough to have a relationship. Or you could hold them down. They could have thought you was weak. They could have even called you with, called you weak. They could have thought this relationship was weak. Mm -hmm, they sure did. And for some of you guys, they thought you was sneaky. They th could have thought you was in, um, yep, that you were fucking with somebody else and you were doing other things. You had other options. Mm -hmm. But they were wrong. I put burdens on them when they made that decision. Actually, that was a very toxic decision here because it brought a lot of distance. Yep. Towards you and them. Damn. Because you were their true, uh, a, a true person, a good person. And for some of you guys, you were their true emperor and an empress that they got distant from. And I told you, they're also dealing with a broken heart. Now, all this fighting here. Yep. Because they're, they want to, they're, they're passionate. The Knight of Wands is also, um, out of all the nights, he's on a very passionate journey, even sexually. Now, when it comes to their passion, their fire, their wand, they're having issues. Yep, inside the hermit. This could be eternal issues. This is also someone here, because of this, in their mental, they're having issues, even f having third parties. Damn. Damn it. Five of Wands, the Knight of Wands, the Ten of Cups, the Hermit. Yep, in the Page of Swords, but they still watch you. This is also someone here that also has trouble concentrating in relationships. Yep. Yeah. Too much grief and sorrow. They could even be dealing with depression. This is crazy as hell. Yeah. Mm -mm -mm. 
this person instead of this person having a conversation with you they based everything off of swords what they thought obviously that's the same thing that uh how they got in the situation they were in in their last relationship swords not by what think what they're thinking Mm-hmm. Swords. There's no cups here. There this person is bad with your intuition. That's why when they come back, they want you and your queen of cup, knight of cup. And I feel like this person's gonna be more in their knight of cup, more kick, um child like inner child creative to open you up. Give me more in this situation overall with the collective. And our person show me something else here. Child, I'm telling you. And they want to want. They want they want to do it. Yep. Even though Pandora's box has opened, even though all this is happened, they want to do it. This is even someone that could want to do it one last time. They could even feel like if you just let them do it. <laughs> this person feels like if you could just, yeah. Now, for some of you guys, yep. For some of you guys, if you do accept this person back, when all this opens up, Pandora's box is going to open. And you're still going to find out that this person could have been lying about a lot of stuff. Um, somebody here is going to be drinking a lot. Could be you and this person when all this shit blow up. Because you still might walk away. Yeah, because over time, you're going to find out there's still some kind of mind games being played. Not just mind games, but even like physical rigor games also being played here. Yeah, and they're playing with your dreams, your emotions, and your feelings. This person doesn't connect very well with cup. Their cup energy. Yep, and you already, you do. And you can feel that. You can also start to say some of the things that this person was trying to tell you or show you this ex could be even true. All right. Not enough of that. Alpha Lucas. So you're going to have to, you know, really dig and dig deep, honey. Okay. All right. Let's pull... Some written messages here. What's the written messages? For Alpha Lucas, for the collective. Thank you, Holy Spirit. My pride and my ego led us astray. Yep. From the door. Um, I miss you more. I miss you uh, more now that we are apart. I still feel your presence in my energy in my in around me. Mm-hmm. What they didn't get from this relationship was a cup. They're not good with that. So it was hard to see you, but it's also hard to miss you. Because you bring that feeling, that emotion, that um, sexual healing energy. That erotic energy. This is what this person seeks. This is what this person seeks in third parties. And they could have found that with you. This could be why this relationship was never working out. And why they are questioning this relationship. One day I believe we will be together again. Mm, ciao. Well. Damn it. Now we got that out the way. Let's see what the overall messages is. Honey bunny. My honey bears that is. Obstacles. Yeah, because this person has found out what it's like to connect with your cup through you, whether you are a man or a woman. And that is very dangerous, honey, because things are falling apart. You look at life different. What you thought, it ain't. What you thought you knew, you don't. <laughs> you How could you know something you never experienced? <laughs> And that's what they're finding out. They thought they could have even knew life. They chose this person based off something they never even understood. Now this person wants a commitment. This is a, a, someone from your past. For a lot of you guys, this is also someone that you could share a past life with. 
They find this connection to be remarkable. That's why. Um, and they recognize it now. The same, way, the same way they didn't recognize you, they recognize you and they're choosing you. It's simple but hard. That's why it's such a challenge. Okay? It's like they're coming back for something. Yeah. That's what you do for this person. So you know. Oh, damn it. Alright. What is the overall oracle love messages? Almighty beautiful universe and the Holy Spirit for Alpha Lucas. Yep, trust. They're going to need you to get you to trust them. And I told you they're going to be very creative, very playfulness. Yep. And they could even be having other people do stuff, getting ideas. Um, It could be a numerous of things. Okay. Let's get you an oracle. Um, they want me to use this one for you, Alpha Lucas. So we will. All right. What is this? Time to rep empty well. What I tell you? Their emotions, they, 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 it's empty. You're filling it up, though. Yeah, yep. It was fated for you to do that. This is also one that feels like they're lucky. And why they feel lucky when they experience you, when they met you, because they could have felt like they was never going to feel this or never would have felt like this or know what this felt like if they didn't, if they didn't meet you. Let's get a soulmate message from this person. Almighty beautiful universe and holy spirits. What is the soulmate message for Alpha Lucas for the weekend? Whenever I see flowers, I think of you what I tell you. They want to give you flowers. Um, you oh my gosh. You inspire me so much. You are my muse. And it inspires them in different ways. Because you when you experience new things, that's what happens. Yeah. Thank you for being so patient with me. For some of you guys, it's your sweetness. It could be your patience. It's your energy. And they makes them feel at home. And when they're with you, everything doesn't matter. The world stops. They even get lost. They forget where they are. Look, and they can feel all the love. They feel it. You are sending me. I can feel all the love and it's electrifying. It's that. that that's what it is. And sometimes that's, it's, you, you know, until someone makes you, it, they feel it, they feel in it, honey. They feel in it. All right. Yep, I just saw forgiveness. What else is here? I'm seeing so many oracles, y'all. We're going to use two oracle decks for you, Alpha Lucas, for some reason. Okay. All right, what's the oracle? Mm -hmm. Thank you. Okay, winter's dream. There, there could have been a very dry, frozen period between you guys here. But whatever it did, the eye of the needle, it helped them see things. Okay? That, um, it might have needed to be helped. Yeah, beginner's mind. And think. And they started to put things together. The energy between you and them. Yep, clarity and organization. Yeah. And here they come. Someone here can also want to stop at your home. And, um, you know, share some things they've been thinking. Be real open, transpersonal. Pair, this is someone that's been watching you. I can't make this shit up. Now, Alpha Lucas, my messages are timeless. So don't so remember whenever you're seeing it, this is when you're supposed to see it. Alright, guys. This is the energy that can happen as we can come towards you from this person. What is do you want to show me out of this deck? Oh my beautiful universe and holy spirit. What was that? Oh, yep. Mm-hmm. Inner child. Yep, this emperor. Someone here also sees you as like a perfect parent. Someone they really can build a family and a home with. Um, and also they feel like uh, that you pull on this person's inner child. Because they're getting something from you that they never got. A queen of cups. You know, queen of cup energy. This person could have... Um, like uh parental issues as well because if they you know maybe um their mom was very hard on them they could even been uh come from a single mom home yeah they feel it here and this is what makes them want to talk to you and for some of you guys this is someone that definitely wants to pop up child for real they've been thinking about it a lot and make a peace offering someone here definitely wants to buy you some flowers that's the peace offering. So someone knows to come with a gift. Come with something to open you up. Come with something to bring a smile on your face. If you a man, then this would be like a card or something. 
Let's get your signs and planets, guys. All right. Well, damn, Alpha Lucas. This was crazy. Hmm. All right. We got Tessorian, Solar Flash, and Arian. Someone here could be a cusper. This could have happened over the last Solar Flash. What I tell you? Nurture. Your nurturing cup. That's that energy. 29-2. You could be also 27. You could be in your 20s. And in your 40s. Early 40s. Yep. Ain't we in retrograde? Child, if we in retrograde, that explains everything. Because so retrograde re off. makes you reflect. Retrograde makes you. That's what it is. That's what it's all about. Fourth house home. Child, somebody here is coming to somebody's house. Yep. I don't feel like you know this yet. This is a deep transformation that this person also went through. That they haven't told you. Damn. Alright, let's get you some hot tea. Alright, now Alpha Lucas is going to be up to you on how you want to handle this. Don't forget, you know, they're general. So that you take what is for you, but... Yeah. All right. This. All right. I think we're cool. I think we good. All right. Tax invasion. I, yep. Someone here was dealing with a dark wit, witch. I told my. The, 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 so someone's a van feminine. Someone told. Your divine feminine or masculine, they will hurt yourself if they leave them. That harm blocked spiritual nourishment. Anytime I see that, I know that's the end of this. Yeah, for some of you guys, this is your spiritual nourishment. So you know that. This is also someone here that could have felt, you know, was dealing with people. Karmics are crazy. Um, I want to see this person's feelings and emotions towards you real quick. Alpha Lucas, I don't think I grabbed them. I don't see them. I might not have grabbed no feelings for you. Emotions, we was getting so much tea, honey, on this message. Damn, let's see what they feel real quick. Detox, yep. Yeah. They've been detoxing from shit. Drinking smoothie, unfriending that asshole, th asshole and throw that shit away. They've been um, detoxing, unfriending. They could have even unfriended you. Yep, your boundaries are trash. <laughs> Block those bad vibes. Yep, they did. They did. At one point in time, fuck shit is about to get real. You need people around you. Now they feel like they need you. And they can't put the fucking phone down from watching you. That's crazy. Well, Alpha Lucas, real quick, just to pull their feelings and emotion before we close it down so you know. But this is what it is. This is what was going on. I hope this helped you out in more than one ways and you got everything you came to seek today. Alpha Lucas, real important before you go, don't forget to connect with me in this reading and other readings that you are getting by liking, subscribing, and sharing, commenting down below, guys. These are general messages, so yes, they will partly resonate in other times fully. All right, so make sure you are stopping by to keep yourself updated with your spiritual updated conversations and messages. Alpha Lucas, I love you. Stay dope. I'll catch you next time you stop by, baby. I'll show you the month.